I'm not even using my glasses. Oh, hey, look. I'm drinking beer. Devil's Peak. It's not an advertising devil. You, you can't get it any place. Anyway, because it comes from Cape Town. They just shipped it over. It's it's rare to get into the middle of uh, Eastern Cape. You know, Cape Cod, okay. Western Cape, just the Eastern Cape. You, to the, you understand. Anyway, the point is, you can't get this beer any place. A lot of places. And I'm not I'm not really a bilge. I mean, I again, it's like strong beer. But this is just very really nice. You know, Devil's Peak. Devil, the, it's part of the um, the whole Table Mountain thing in uh, in Cape Town. I explained this before, right? You, you have if, you, if you're looking at it from from looking at the mountain, right? You have Devil's Peak over here, Woodstock down there. Then you have uh, Table Mountain. Then you have Lion's Head, right? And it goes to the beach over there. It goes sort of like that. You know what I mean? It doesn't matter. The point is, we're having a beer drinking session right now. Top right there. Sorry about that. Okay. I won't even put the glasses on because here's, here's the thing. I'm gonna go try to get to the point real, real quick. From now until like uh, uh, like you know June, I give it the time for you know uh, people are, are sniping at each other. You know organizations that go. I don't know why. I don't know why I even bother with ADOS. In fact, somebody uh, I was listening. I was uh, listening to Tariq. And he said something very interesting. He said, ADOS is a hashtag. He, said, well, he doesn't really comment on it. He said he doesn't comment on it. He says hashtag. Which is true. That's the whole thing. You know, this, this it's, it's an amazing thing. It's a hashtag. It's a modern movement. That's what fascinates me. You know, it's a hash, the hashtag brought it on. But that hashtag released a modern thing, released all these people to say, hey, that's right. That's what we are. It's lineages. Da, 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 da. So you latch on to what, what attorney, um, uh, Antonio Moore is saying, latch on what Vets saying. They put it, they concretize it for us. We have our own ideas, research going, and that's how it goes. Anyway, so anyway, I had written something down. I had written something and sent it in. Um, uh, and I had said, uh, well, let me go back to this thing here. Wait a second. I had said something. What did I say? <coughs> here it is. Uh, ADOS is a political reality based on data and facts. Okay. One, uh, one purposes of ADOS is the collection of a debt due. No other group has that claim. And then I put the no other group has that claim. Okay, fine. I should stop it there because what he says is something else. He, 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 um, well, let me finish it. Let me finish. Then I go back to that. Right. Then I continue next next paragraph. The unity is the unity of a of a the unity is the unity of a southwestern African species of spider that builds a huge web from all all the participants, all little spiders. Right. Each spider builds their own node. Uh, and and uh, their own node that attach to other nodes, right? And and that's the unity of purpose. Because all these remember, the spider has their own little node. They attach and they attach and they have this big web that they they do between trees. And so they capture oh much more insects because they've cooperated. But remember, they have each individual node is doing this. The unity they have is unity of purpose. It's not the unity we're getting together because we know we need to be uni unified. Da, da, da. It's unity of purpose. Anyway, I, I'm gonna keep on going. Folks should check the website www.ados101.com. I say that all the time. Maybe I then I go on. Dot, dot, dot. As a denizen of the code, as articulated by Mr. Neely Foolish Jr., I can tell you if one embraces the code, Neely Foolish Jr., code, right? And becomes an ADOS citizen researcher, a data collector, and dissemination of, of information, right? That is a powerful movement towards a liberation reality. That's what I wrote, okay? So now this guy writes me back. And this is what I love about the, you know, when people do that. He says, he says, um, he says no, in all capital letters, no other group, comma, uh, question mark, obviously you have done no research. Okay. Let's say I had done no research. That's fine. But if you say obviously I've done no research, that means that well, you give me some research. No, what what other group has done this? That's all I'm asking in history. Now what whatever then I then I answer. I don't know if I answered his name. What other group then I answered to this guy? Um, I'm not gonna okay, this matter. What other group in our American lineage experience has accurately named our circumstance? And I put a, a, a bracket S, close bracket, like circumstances, circumstances, right? 
and has begun with the use of data, begun with the use of data to make a claim to the government of the debt due. Oh, let me read more. Wait. So that's so my question. He asked me a question. He didn't. What he asked. I said, well, and then I, I'm giving an answer. I said, well, I haven't found any group that has used, you know, data and sued the United States government. Anyway, they never sued the government. We brought it up to the United States. We're not suing it. That's the other thing. People, we're not suing the United States government. We're saying, you owe us a debt. Pay up. That's all. Right? This debt is not due from the United States. I'm sorry. This debt, I'm sorry, I anticipated something he was, that the person was trying to hint at, that, you know, other groups, they tried to petition the United Nations and stuff like that. Okay, so I said, this debt is not due from the United Nations or white people to their, to, um, to uh, or white people, be they supremacists or not. Let me repeat that sentence. This debt, the debt due, ADOS, Americans of dis, uh, uh, the North American descendants of chattel slavery, this debt that's due this grouping, right? This lineage. This debt is is not due from the United Nations. Can't take the United Nations. They, they can't pay us, right? Or white people, be they supremacists or not. We're not going to white people. We're going to the United States government. This is about a debt due. Uh, from is this is this is about a debt due from what is this was supposed to be this is about a debt due from oh is this supposed to be this is not about a debt due uh, from any individuals oh this is what I love about the uh, modern whatever I can correct that little mistake by saying edit since I'm the one that did it and I can edit my thing so I say da 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 give it by all these ways whatever. I go with AUS, uh, this is revolutionary. Well, what are I thought I did that already. Okay. This debt is not due from the United States, from the United Nations, or White House, or white people, as they be they supremacists or not. This is about a debt due. This is not about. That's what it's supposed to be right there. Not about. A debt due from any individuals. This is, oh, I didn't do that. Maybe this thing. This is has an S there. Let me correct that. This is a debt due from an institution, re United States government, to a to a historically downtrodden grouping of people. Right? What other group has framed their uh, their agenda? www.adwest101.com. Right? Around these current circumstances. Now there's a trick thing. We're talking about current circumstances. We have some these circumstances just came up in the last, you know, say five years. So we're not talking about a group that was beyond five years because they didn't have the same data. And when they, when they did get the data, they didn't do anything uh, anything with it, right? Okay, gotcha. Uh, uh, around these current circumstances, ADOS is a natural evolutionary move. It's a natural a natural progression in in our liberation, right? All right, move. And current tip of the spear of our current, um, no, current, current one, uh, thrust towards liberation. And, oh, let me change this one too. Let me, I gotta do this one too. Uh, uh, current is, uh, and, and supposed to be the tip of the spear. Let me take this up. And, and, the tip of the spear of our current thrust towards liberation. Accept the fact. Give ADUS some breathing room. Even give ADUS some encouragement. Yeah, that's what you could do, right? And by all means necessary, other groups need to continue this struggle with their resources towards our ultimate liberation. All other groups need to keep on doing what they're doing. This just so happens that ADUS is the current tip of the spear. It's easy to understand, okay? So that's what I wrote that person. I didn't get any, any feedback from that yet. I'm thank, oh, thank you for, for being patient so I can correct this as we go along. We said, what I, this, is what we, this is what's so amazing about the, the, the everything. Okay, what I just did, for instance, if I, back in the old days, back in the days of black liberation, you know, we're talking about, you know, uh, uh, the black arts movement. Say we was gonna do a demonstration, whatever we had to do, we had these, 
things like carbon, these papers with some some carbon oh, in there, whatever have you. Put it in a type, or put a you put it in a typewriter. You type up the thing. It's a stencil. You come in the stencil. You put the stencil on the thing, and you and you run it off. And if you have a mistake, oh, I did that. It's a mistake. You can't go back two days later, you know, or a day later. I guess this is, and correct the thing. You can't do it. So we have so many things that's different that's going for us. We should work with our differences. A lot of the folks, when when, when you started a group, you started a group, and you, you started the group, and and you started a group with, with the stuff that you had and with the information you had. But now you never updated your group. If if in other words, if you was if you was 39 years old when you started your your group, the question is, and say you're 59 now, the question is, wait a second, where's the where's the other 39 year? Where's the 29 year? You see, if you don't have that in place, if you don't have that lineage in place, then your group is going to be mired in the thing that you did 30 years ago or whatever it was. You see, there's no progression. Plus, plus a lot of these old heads don't want to listen to anybody. Okay, it doesn't matter. Anyway, let me, let me stop right there. That's all I have to say. Me, 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 T from the Pattersons taking the train to Tibet. Letting you know what I only suspect. And thanks once again for being patient and listening to all of this as we sort things out from the American deaths right here. You know, the deaths of the, right there, of the North American descendants of chattel slavery. There you go.